At Care Patron, we are constantly looking at ways to improve. If you have any feedback on how we can improve our videos and resources, please leave us a comment in the comment section below. Body Mass Index, or BMI, is a numerical measurement used to estimate body fat based on a person's weight and height. It's calculated by dividing weight in kilograms by height in meters squared. According to the World Health Organization in 2010, a BMI between 18.5 and 24.9 is generally considered healthy for adults. However, this standard doesn't account for differences in gender, ethnicity, age, or muscle mass. For example, postmenopausal women may carry more body fat, especially around the abdomen, even if their BMI appears normal, potentially increasing their risk for health issues like diabetes and heart disease. Because of such limitations, experts suggest using other indicators like waist circumference or body fat percentage for a more accurate assessment, especially for this group. BMI is also not suitable for pregnant individuals due to physiological changes that affect body weight and composition. You can use the women's BMI chart by age or female BMI chart by age template to assess and monitor your patient's weight status relative to their height, age, and overall health. To make the most out of the template, here's a step-by-step -step guide on how you may use it. Step one, calculate BMI. You can start by collecting patient data needed to calculate BMI, such as the weight and height. Afterward, use the following formula, weight in kilograms divided by height in meters squared. Alternatively, you can use a body mass index calculator or BMI calculator instead. Step two, compare the calculated BMI with the chart. Locate the BMI value on the chart. A BMI of 19 to 24 is typically considered healthy. Higher values may signal overweight or obesity. Step three, assess the patient's overall health. Consider other factors such as age, muscle mass, ethnicity, and health history, since BMI alone doesn't give a complete picture. Step four, discuss results with the patient. Review the BMI results in the context of overall health. Talk about potential health risks, recommend further tests if needed, and plan follow-up actions. BMI is a helpful screening tool, but has its limits. It's most effective when used alongside other health assessments to ensure a complete evaluation, especially for postmenopausal women and those with unique body compositions. You can learn more about topics like the BMI chart for women by age in our guides library on our Care Patron website. Visit our website and sign up for free. If this video is helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out more of our content.